What's up guys and welcome back to another video right into my YouTube channel. Today I'm gonna basically tell you how to fix every kind of crashing, lagging or freezing issue you're currently having with RimWorld. So stick to the end guys, this will be a step by step tutorial and in the end you'll perfectly know what to do in order to fix this kind of issue. Before we start right into the video, I just want you guys to know or let you guys know that I would really really appreciate it if you would just leave a like, a comment or a subscription right into my YouTube channel. It would really make my day and help me out as a little YouTuber as I am. Especially subscribing would be such a big support for me guys, you would support my work here on YouTube a little bit and I'm gonna really really be thankful for that and I'm gonna thank you for that. So anyways, I would just say let's get right started. So the first step is gonna be to navigate to the very bottom of your screen where you're gonna right click your task bar and open up your task manager. Once you did that, I want you to navigate to the top left corner of your screen where you're gonna click into processes. And afterwards, I want you to simply end every single task which is currently running. And I know guys, it's going to sound a little bit weird, but let me explain it to you. So there are two reasons for that. So first of all, um, too many applications, background processes, programs, games, running at the same time on a low-end or bad PC will cause your PC to crash, lag, or freeze in some way. Just to simply end every single task. And the second reason, like it was for me, there are some applications or background processes, don't ask me why, which are, which are currently third-party in your game, causing it to crash in some way and just... You need to end every single task to figure out which one it is. So by just simply ending every single task, you're avoiding this issue. And you're helping you a lot with that. So once you're finished, I want you to end the task manager again. And afterwards, search an empty spot on your desktop where you're going to right click and simply hit display settings. Afterwards, hit display. And I want you to identify which your main monitor is. And obviously, this just applies if you have more than one. So once you identified it, scroll down and go to scale and layout, where I want you to change the size of text apps and other items to 100% as recommended. And the display resolution should be the same as in game. So, for example, if you have an in game 1720 by 1070, I also want you to do this for your display resolution, or you're going to apply this to your display resolution. Afterwards, end settings again and navigate to the very left bottom of your screen where you're going to open up your settings. Navigate right onto Update and Security and stick around Windows Update. And I know guys it's going to sound a little bit basic, but trust me, updating every single drive you could possibly update on your PC will help you with every kind of issue you're currently having and also with crashing, lagging and freezing. So just trust me and update this uh, driver, so your Windows driver, once you're finished and this task. And do the same thing for a graphics card. So go to your browser, go to your application and down the latest version of your driver just to provide the best possible performance in general for your PC. Yeah guys, I hope that I could actually help you out of this video. If it was like that, just leave a like, a comment or a subscription. I'm gonna really be thankful for that. And yeah guys, I'm really sorry if I couldn't help you, but I'm just gonna do my best in order to help you out. Either way, I hope you guys have a wonderful day. See you at the next one and bye.